All right, I'm going to show you a little bit more about um, the watermark features. Um, it's pretty simple, but there's a lot you can do with it. Um, you can see here, I've got an example. There's an image here, and these are the elements. It's got a picture of the realtor, the name, and then phone number and web address. And uh, it's a transparent PNG. And I did it in Photoshop, but you could, you could use other other uh, software for that but uh, the idea is if we go and then I put the URL to that image from my Dropbox I put it in in um, in the watermark image field let's go ahead and take a look at it in Photoshop so uh, I've got the image here and then I just use text you can see that this the size of this is um, 360 high by 640 wide and uh, you could put the text you know wherever you want that makes sense but I, I put it up here at the top because the text I use typically ends up at the bottom right bottom left or across the centered in the bottom or in the middle so uh, up here it kind of stays out of the way now you could do some other things like maybe you want to shrink down this text and maybe you'd rather have it over here so that could be another option if it's big enough to be able to read still so um Let's uh, try that again. Anyway, you get the idea. So I put that there. Maybe move it up a little bit. So it's still out of the way. Still would be legible on the screen. And um, so you just save it into your Dropbox or somewhere online where it can be publicly available for the rendering process. And, um, and now uh, you have a watermark there. And then if you want if you know the rules of using, uh, if you have a realtor client, they will have rules about logo use and you know where it has to be and how big does it have to be and you know in relation to their contact info and stuff like that. So, uh, but an easy thing to do is just use a name and contact info and uh, or business name and contact info or whatever. Just it, you don't have to have a picture here; it could just be the text in the top left corner, uh, a logo in the bottom right, and things like that. So. Um, so you can see I've got it, um, that's what I've got here. Now I can also play with the transparency. If I bring it down, we'll still see if it's legible or not. Or if it, we can see what it's doing. Shrink this down. Let's go to the ending. Preview this. Okay, so that's a little... Schedule a showing today. Too Call dark. Susie right, Seller right. at 800-555-1212. Um, also, by the way, you notice how it kind of did the one, two, and then pause one, two. So it, it sounded really natural. Uh, that did not happen the way, you know, it took a few times to, tr to try that. But um, if I go into that slide, first let's bring the transparency back up. And then let's go into that slide and look at the text to speech. Now you notice how I did this. There's no dashes, just spaces. There's commas. A comma will create a pause. Um, so you, you see here it says 800 555 and it says each one each one individually um, and then uh, 1212 so uh, by playing around with that I was able to kind of get that to sound better at the end there okay let's preview this again schedule a showing today Call Susie Seller at 800-555-1212. So um, transparency is still pretty uh, light there. Or it's almost, it almost looks 100%, but it actually has a, it's about 70. Um, anyway, you can see that it has a lot of features you can play with. You could also, for the ending slide, you could just, this whole thing could be an image, you know, um, that you do in Photoshop. Or if you have a designer, or if you are a designer, you could design something that's pretty pretty cool. And of course, uh, you can do all kinds of videos. I'm doing real estate here, but you could do do commercial for dentists, chiropractors, uh, roofers, and plumbers and painters, and all kinds of things where you just kind of build it here. And then the power of this though is you you come up with a nice video, but where it gets really powerful is you can deploy these things over and over and over again to YouTube tweak the keywords, put it out there, and uh, you could do one a week or even potentially one a day if you um, 
the client's paying you enough to do that, you could even outsource this pretty easily. So, all right, so that covers uh, a little bit more of the watermark and some, some of the text-to-speech there.